If you are drowning in sweat during the summer, then you are doing something wrong. So if you're wearing clothes that are just too heavy, trap moisture, or even just the wrong fabric, then you do not know how to dress this summer. But lucky for you, you clicked on a video that's going to show you exactly how to dress this summer. And if that confused you, that's this video right now. And it's going to be with the help of today's video sponsor. Abercom. But first let's talk about something because the other day I realized something. It was officially the first day of the summer. And so it got me wondering two things. Did I have the right pieces for the summer? And the second thing was, is the first day of the summer the same for the entire world? Honestly, I only know the answer to one of those. And so I realized my summer wardrobe can be a little bit better. So I turned to Abercrombie and Fitch. So let's go over exactly what the right pieces are. The first one being a sweater polo. This is a pretty lightweight and soft shirt to be wearing this summer. Next up was a linen shirt. Remember how I mentioned that you need the right fabric? Well, linen is the perfect fabric for the summer. Linen doesn't only come in shirts because there's also some linen pants. And for the longest, I would never wear pants for the summer, just shorts because I thought it would be too hot. Well, a pair of linen pants like this solve that problem. But of course, shorts are essential for the summer and having some good chino shorts would definitely be a good option this summer because these are still lightweight, still very breathable. And because of the color, they are very versatile. And then I have a camp colored silky button down. I'm such a huge fan of the silky material Definitely switch up from anything I've ever worn. And definitely switch up from anything else you'll see. Because when have you seen a shirt like this? Exactly. You probably have it. So this will definitely make you stand out. Just like the next one, which is going to be a camp collar 90s bowling shirt. Another piece that you rarely see. And honestly, bowling shirts are an upcoming trend. And this one from Abercrombie is the perfect one. Now, I'm not just going to leave you high and dry. Because I am going to show you exactly how to wear these pieces right now. Okay, so this is the first outfit. All in an outfit. You can't get a better summer outfit than this. Of course, there's little things that you could do to improve it. Or what you do is tuck it in. Now look, you can't tell me this isn't one of the best summer outfits. Colors on point, the fabric on point, and the fact that it's from Abercrombie just makes it 10 times better. Now I've said it once and I'll continue to say it. Sweater polos are one of the best pieces that you could wear this summer. And if this outfit doesn't show you that, then I don't know what to tell you anymore. And look at this monochrome outfit. You gotta think who's wearing stuff like this. So something like this will make you stand out 10 times more. And now look at this one. The shorts are sitting exactly where they should be. And the name of this shirt definitely doesn't lie. It is extremely silky, extremely soft. Honestly, I could already tell you that this is gonna be one of my favorites to wear. I love the way this one looks. Very unique, definitely pretty bold. Not only because of the color, but the graphic. Although you're going to be stepping out of your comfort zone with this one, you're going to be very comfortable stepping out of that comfort zone. Look, all the pieces are going to be linked directly here on YouTube. And you could use code YouTubeAF, which obviously stands for Abercrombie & Fitch, for 15% off up until June 28th. And trust me, you're not going to want to miss these. All right, so now that we have the outfits down, what else can we do to look better this summer? Accessories. Let's talk about the first one, and that is going to be a watch. Now, I will always recommend the watch because it's something that not a lot of younger guys are wearing, but I definitely think that you should. Now, when I first got into watches, I realized that I should have been wearing this a lot sooner. It makes you look more mature, a little bit more put together, and it can still be very casual. If you want to have a casual watch, get something like a G-Shock. If you want to have something a little bit more grown up, a little bit more sophisticated, something like a Seiko. My favorite one is going to be this Tissot Gentleman Powermatic 80. Now, granted, this one's a little bit more on the pricey side. One fact, it's literally the most expensive watch that I own, but you don't have to go with this one. As long as it's stainless steel or silver, then it's going to make you look a lot more sophisticated. So, and just like that, my outfit has a little bit more depth. So let's continue this out. Right now, I'm just wearing a black shirt. And my outfit is very basic from what I'm wearing right now. It's definitely nothing like I was wearing from Abercrombie, but let's make the outfit that I'm wearing right now a little less boring. I mentioned earlier that accessories are a good way to do that. And I'll follow up on that in a bit. Now look, the best way to layer is with a tank top. So that way it doesn't get too hot. But the shirt that I'm wearing is very lightweight and therefore you could definitely throw something on. Looking through my wardrobe and something that I mentioned previously, let's throw on this camp colored shirt. Obviously you don't want to sweat in the summer. Everybody is so scared to layer in the summer because they don't want to get too hot, but that's why you need the right pieces. And having something like silky camp colored shirt is perfect because it's not too hot. Honestly, it doesn't even feel like I threw anything over this. It feels the absolute same from what I was wearing earlier, but no matter how good the pieces are, accessories will still make any outfit look better. And so the next accessory is gonna be a chain. I honestly rarely take this one off. So we're gonna keep on the one that I normally wear, but stacking looks really good as well. So if you have a longer chain or a longer necklace, it's gonna look good as well. Honestly, I'm still a really big fan of pearls, even though a lot of people think they're dead. And even though they're not as popular, I'm still gonna continue to wear them throughout the summer because let's be real, they still look pretty good. And again, it'll just make any outfit look better, but we're not done with jewelry. Another thing you could do is throw on some rings. Now I like two to three rings, but for the sake of the video, I'm only gonna be wearing one. All the accessories that I just threw on, although they make your outfit look better, they don't really do anything for the summer. So let's talk about some things that are not only gonna make you look better, but things that are very practical and will make your life significantly better through the summer. 
So the first thing that we could throw on is something like a hat. And that way you, the top of your head isn't gonna burn because it's a real thing to get sunburns on the top of your head. And although I personally never felt it, I'm trying to keep it that way because I heard it sucks. I heard it's very painful. I never want to experience that and a hat will definitely help you prevent that. Or the next thing is going to be some sunglasses. Now, although I do own some designer sunglasses, I will say they're honestly not the best nor worth that kind of money. And so for me personally, I prefer Ray-Ban. I think the quality on those are really good. They go well with the price. So those are going to be the ones that I recommend. Anyway, something else that you need for the summer is going to be some white sneakers. Now, I like my summer white sneakers to be a little bit more chunky. And I've said it so many times in this channel, but my most recent pickup is one of the best summer sneakers to be wearing out there. And that's going to be some Puma Slipstreams, the ones that I have, are in collab with Ami Paris. Let me tell you, I love these. I've been getting a lot of compliments with these, so I'm definitely gonna be wearing these a lot throughout the summer. And this next one is very important, yet so overlooked, especially for younger guys. As a younger guy, I completely understand that you think the sun doesn't do anything to you except get you sunburned. But what everybody fails to realize is that the sun is very harmful to your skin. And although you can't see it right away, over time, your skin is gonna age a lot faster because of the sun. So not only do you need moisturizer, but you need some good sunscreen, especially on your face. With that being said, speaking about sunscreen, you definitely need it everywhere because let me tell you, I went out the other day and my neck got burnt so fast. And this was one of the first times I went out in the summer and I was so upset that my neck already got burned. And it definitely could have been worse, but I have such a low pain tolerance that it hurt no matter what. And it could have been easily avoided had I just put on sunscreen, but I forgot. And by the time I remembered, I was too lazy to do it. But now I know because moving forward, there is not gonna be a day that I'm stepping into that sun without sunscreen. And I definitely recommend that you do the same thing. But that being said, everything I mentioned will help you dress better this summer. Again, it's a huge thank you to Abercrombie & Fitch for sponsoring today's video. And I'm so happy to show you all the pieces that I'm going to be wearing from Abercrombie. Now, I really only talked a little bit about shoes, but if you want to know the three sneakers that you need, then I have a video that's going to show you exactly that. But other than that, I hope you have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next video. Later.